Eric Kurland. Uh, I'm doing the uh, 3D version of this video. For All Is Not Lost, we have a, a Panasonic 3D A1 camera, which is a prosumer camera that actually is essentially two cameras in one camera body. It's got two lenses, two sensors, and uh, records separate left and right to two SD cards. What we've done is rigged it up shooting into a mirror up to the, the plexiglass stage so that we can have enough distance between the dancer's feet and the camera lens. The dancer's feet when you watch this in 3D, it looks like they're right on the screen surface, and then the dancers extend in depth back into the screen. Uh, I think this video is actually a great opportunity to, to try something that, that maybe uh, people aren't used to. Everyone always thinks 3D is supposed to be popping off the screen and in your face, and here we're actually using all the space behind the screen um, where, where the, the dance is happening, and I think that's it's going to be a really interesting thing to watch. The White Knuckles video, the, the video with all the dancing dogs that we shot last Year, loaded onto the Nintendo 3DS, which is a, a game system with an auto stereoscopic screen. So it's a screen that doesn't require glasses like the ones I've got on. On here, you just hit the play button and find the sweet spot, and you can watch the video in 3D on here. I actually shot it with, uh, uh, with this, which is just a, a little homemade camera rig with uh, two Canon point and shoots and a uh, Altoids controller so I can make both cameras uh, record and stop. There's going to be a whole bunch of, of new handheld devices coming out with screens like this. Uh, several cell phone companies have announced they're going to have screens uh, that work without 3D glasses and so on. So I think we're actually going to see a lot of opportunity to get 3D, uh, 3D short content out there. Um, it, it's definitely coming.